Vasquez, 10 days after the first fight, surgery to with four knockouts. The champion in his prime. And, at and the key unified rules for this world title fight. There's no 120. Dance at 37 wins. Three. Stinging jab and the sharp combinations. Vasquez in the every minute count. And he is who had a great first round in the original. Would come right at him. This round. Marquez lands when he jabs his way in. He was very better early because it's helping him work his way right inside. There's a straight right hand to the to the nose by Marquez and Vasquez sending Marquez back with a shot. There's good news and bad news for both fighters. Vasquez is landing his left hook very, very well early. Marquez is and he feel Marquez will eventually catch Vasquez and end it dramatically. Mark did not specify the round. Right uppercut on the inside there by Marquez. A flurry by Vasquez. Back comes great. Marquez. Again, back and forth. Two-way. Non-stop sustained action. What else is new? Great skill on the inside. Marquez's uppercut was a factor in the first fight and could be again. And there it is again for Marquez. This is great, great boxing here in round one by both men. And in a way, it is like round eight. The hand speed edge from and get by. He better hope. Vasquez that he has the power to hurt Marquez again. Ready here in the first round. It's a very effective weapon. Both men want to keep their hands up more. They feel like they lowered their hands and it was a problem in the last fight. He had his hands up, so he kind of blocked them. Oh, good body work. Body shots. And a good left. As who, as we at a critical time heading into the rematch, the longtime trainer of Marco Antonio Barrera. Now, in the now, Marquez told us before this fight he would throw more punches than he did in the last fight. So round two scheduled for 12 for the WBC 122 pound. He's also a very skilled fighter in there. Trying to keep Matt Bay off balance with the jab from the referee Guadalupe Garcia from Mexico City. Good right hand by Israel Vasquez after a jab. Didn't hurt knockout punch. It's mostly the left hook. There are so many good punches being thrown. Dropped Marquez in round three of the first fight. Marquez that started the damage. You know, Marquez, it's tempting because he can throw the hook, Marquez. Beautiful left hook wow. there by Vasquez. Yeah. Best punch of the fight for him so far. That got Marquez to 10, and Marquez was unfazed. There's another one. Indeed. Round three. Bar. They are in front of each other, throwing excellent punch. The chance that they can be hit. Makes it more exciting for the fans, of course. But, but oh, what a oh, he's, in, oh, he's wobbled. Marquez is on a left hook that hurt him in the first fight. Let's see if Vasquez jumps all over Marquez now. He has Marquez in some trouble, but look at Marquez fighting back. Oh. Unbelievable. And Marquez showed great poise when he was knocked down the first time, but he was more hurt this time. Yes, he was. He came back with a good fourth round of that first fight after being knocked down to the third, but he really got jolted here. Same round, too. Exactly. He has slowed down considerably now, Marquez. Now Marquez comes back with a left hook. And a straight right and a left hook by Vasquez. Back comes a right hand by Marquez. Marquez pressed up against the ropes, not where he wants to be. A left hook to the temple by Vasquez. Can you say Corrales Castillo? This is an amazing round of boxing. Great Big uppercut. uppercut. Uppercut by Vasquez. It sends Marquez back to the ropes. Marquez, though, swings away anyway. And he comes from the right side. Israel Vasquez. Heads may have collided. Oh, Marquez has gotten himself back into this round in a major way. Amazing. And now Vasquez with some drama. He's got problems with the cuts. And 45 seconds left in the third round. And Marquez landing with rights and left, sending Vasquez back. Oh. Another series of punches, a great combination by Marquez. And this is after Marquez was in trouble. Marquez ways of Vasquez. Marquez, everything's connecting. But look who's coming forward. It's Vasquez. Now Marquez comes forward. Back comes Vasquez with a left and a right. Non-stop. Incredible action. Unbelievable. A right hand attack Marquez. And then later in the round, Rafael Marquez, after he had been hurt, came back in this round. The action was just spectacular. Both men landing big punches. There's the very close round after Marquez had been Vasquez corner. 
Vasquez marching forward. What a work rate by both guys. Now Vasquez dealing underneath the right eye of Marquez, and that could become a factor. Beautiful right uppercut on the inside by Vasquez oh, on the chin. The legs of Marquez not steady right now. Oh, what a body shot by Marquez. That hurt Vasquez. That was a great link. Moment. Took a Vasquez, and boy, Vasquez has found a way to land it against Marquez. It's been a big weapon. And I'll tell you one mistake, Mark. As they trade in the center of the ring. Big right hand there by Marquez. So he's going back to Took because that puts him in harm's way to get the left hook blinking heavily. We've heard in the first one. It is. Making itself known again. One throws and the other throws. And the other one comes back. First fight, Israel Vasquez says, I'm coming up from 118 in the last fight. But you wouldn't know it. Very close. Oh, oh what a right hand by Marquez up top. Vasquez coming oh. back. Back comes Marquez. We see the right overhead right by Vasquez. He got off to a very quick start in that round. Marquez ripping this monstrous left hook downstairs. Look at him. Wow. I mean, that was a great body punch. And it pushed Vasquez back. I think he had his way with a freight train right hand. Followed the champion, Rafael for 12 for Bantamweight Championship. Injury after the seventh round of the original. Marquez is backing himself into the ropes more than I think they would like. And, and giving Vasquez a chance to work the body in the head. And remember, he's been hurt so much, you already start to ask yourself, who's better conditioned? Ballyhood rival is it? Midway through. By the way, a big issue, and it was not caught. So that's going to be an issue for bleeding more heavily now. It's getting into the right eye more than the cut around the left eye. Marquez's jab has not been quite as effective in the last couple of rounds. It, it would be a punch. It could open up. Oh, that there wow. goes Vasquez, but it's being ruled a slip. As the blood continues to streak down Vasquez's right side, he comes roaring back. They trade toe-to-toe -to -toe in the center of the ring. Vasquez pushing Marquez back. Psychologically, Vasquez caught Mar Marquez at a vulnerable moment. Marquez thought it was a knockdown and thought the guy might be hurt. Vasquez came right after. Yeah, he sensed that maybe Marquez let down momentarily yeah. and tried to take advantage of the situation. What a close round here, though, in the top of the head of Marquez. Let's take a look and see if we think this could have been a knockdown. Very hard to tell when it happened in the, uh, no, it was a slip. Definitely like this, that could be a factor. We'll see again from an overhead. No, the right hand missed, they clat, they. A slip, still looking a little bit on the dazed side. Oh, down goes Marquez! Which is a key point. Lots of time for Vasquez to get something done. Remember, Marquez came back the last time he was knocked down in the third round of the first fight. Will it happen again? Vasquez looking to close the show. He's going in for the finish. Canvassing Marquez. Marquez almost working on instinct. Oh, a right uppercut on the inside of Vasquez. A left hook by Vasquez. Marquez holding on up against the ropes. Vasquez all over Marquez. Can he end it here in the sixth round? Relentless attack. By Israel Vasquez, he's got Marquez pressed up against the ropes just above us. Back goes Marquez. Garcia steps in. The fight is over. Had hurt Marquez earlier in the fight. Lands right on the point of the chin. Sends him down. Yet another look at the. And look how low the right hand is for Marquez. And he got hit with the. Larry Garcia stops the action. No question. Marquez was in some trouble. Now he slipped. Still punching back. Moves backward. Well, I'm going to be honest. The of the world, Israel, el magnífico. His mind that led him to believe there was further trouble and damage. ¿Qué estaba pasando por tu mente que tú decidiste? En ese momento, yo estaba muy atento, muy concentrado, viendo que Israel Vázquez estaba dominando claramente las acciones.